if we want another folder, okay? Actually, we do not, uh, if we do not, uh, what we call, we do not set our computer or our application. Everything is outside the folder, right? It should be a specific folder. For example, we keep our CSS in our CS folder, right? JavaScript in JS folder, right? In PHP in some kind of public folder, right? So we need something, something like that. So we don't want to do one by one, okay? We don't want to do one by one. We want to make this composer help us to, to generate it for us. As I show you on the slides, okay? I show you on the slide, this, uh, this one, okay? Standard PHP packet skeleton, okay? Try to run this one, okay? Try to run this one, for example. I run it, I copy it, and then I run on my terminal, okay? Run it my own terminal, okay? I then I enter. Okay? Don't worry, it will crash or not. It, it better on your lap, okay? <laughs> It based on your computer, okay? Now I'm showing that one, one package, or one company, one library, or one kind of things that happen to, to my folder, okay? To my folder, to my project folder, okay? That I install one thing that we call Skeleton, okay? This is the package name on the internet. I download it and install, put it on my folder. That name is project, okay? Project, okay? So when you go to check, when you go and check um, your folder, you will got something. It's working. Not sure. What's going on? Can you check again? It's working now. Okay. Install the package. It will install a package here. Okay. It will install a package here. But when you want to use it, you have to go to check how to use it. This one. Okay. For example, here. Where is it? Where is it? This one. Okay. I search this one, okay, I search this one. How to use this one, okay, standard PHP package skeleton. I copy, I use Google, okay, I use Google. Don't worry, you can use Google also, it's free. Okay, <laughs> it's free. <laughs> okay, when you search, okay, when you search this one, you will got one thing that is on a GitHub, okay, a GitHub. Remember, we already discussed about GitHub last week, right? Okay, if you miss, okay, go and review our video. On the I'm not sure I already uploaded or not, but go and make sure that you have completed the task, okay? This one, PHP package skeleton, okay? You go this one, um, and then it will tell you how to use this one, okay? How to use this one. It will explain you a uh, thing, that folder, okay? This one, this is, will be the, the common name, okay? The general name that I can say that any framework on this earth using this one to be a standard one, okay? They will say that, for example, public will hold the web server file, okay? Config will hold the configuration file, for example, database connection, something like that. The bin will hold the um, command line execution, something that you run on terminal, it will put on this one, okay? PHP source code will be on SRC. You have the test code will be in here. This is the folder that this person uh, tried to do a research and that, that the, the folder should be naming like this, okay, naming like this. I, some, I know that someone tried to do, for example, document, not docs, okay? If you say document, it's okay, but not standard one, okay? If you say public, I, I, I want to do something as a publication, for example, okay? You, you, you can do your own, but you cannot talk to people around the world, okay? You talk to me, publication, I don't know. You may publish paper, I don't know. If you say, uh, I do public, okay, my computer web application. So I know, all oh, this is the file for any, anyone on the internet can access uh, to your resource via public, okay, on your uh, web application, that if, if you're online on that, that website, okay. The, the file that they, something like this. We need something like this, okay, this folder and this file, this file attached to, and, and then create that, to our project, okay, the project, okay, project, project, right? So, how do you use it? There are manual here, okay? There are manual here. Don't, don't worry, okay, don't worry. This one. Okay. You can use this one, okay? Run this one. When the bins generated, something like this. I copied it, okay, I just copied. I don't know how to do, okay? I just copy, okay? Um, and then I run, because I already on, remember that I already on my project, okay? I put it here, 
Okay, Iran. Something happened, right? Something happened. It generate me a bin config dot public resource SRC test and blah, blah blah something like this. And then if we check our our list, okay, you will see there are something adding to our computer. Okay, adding to our computer. You see this one. Before we have just only composer dot JSON, composer dot log, and then we have vendor, right? Vendor. Okay. Right now we have the file, the folder name. Okay, the folder name. Let's check to the our our finder, our explorer. Okay, our explorer. You can see here. Okay. Right now our application become like this. Okay, become like this. This folder. Okay. Okay. You do not do such right click and add folder. Okay, please do not do such that before you starting skeleton. Okay, except you have additional extra for thing that you want to add. Okay, magic, right? Quick, right? Right. Very simple. See, very simple. This is we call modern modern way of development. So, if you want to add some kind of um, file, you just go and add it. Okay, you can go and edit. Okay, for example, here, um, vendor source. For example, I want to add PHP new file. PHP, okay. For example, index. Okay, this one. Okay. Echo. Salamu. Alaikum. Okay. And okay, it should be start uh, by PHP, right? Mm -hmm. Hello, PHP. Okay. okay, this one. Now you already run the PHP, okay? You already run the PHP by using by echo hello, okay, in your computer, index.php, okay?